Hi, my name is Ramesh. This video is about Blue Smart Socket, which is a Android operator, uh, the portable home socket. The content of this video is organized in these pages. My name is Ramesh. I work as a senior software developer. And as a hobby, I work in microchip programming. The Bluetooth, Blue Smart Socket is an Android mobile operator's smart home power socket. Using this device, you can turn on the appliances on demand. You can tear, uh, put um, automatic turn on on home appliances such as oven, um, fans, and ACs. Um, Micro C assembler is used in this. Uh, programming and an Android app framework for the Android app. Protoss for the simulation. The concept of this um, device is the USART module in the PIC controller will communicate uh, to the Bluetooth device in serially, and uh, the serial um, the PIC controller will control the all the appliances. The mobile device will communicate to the Bluetooth and Bluetooth will communicate to the um, PIC controller. The PIC controller understands what's the signal and will turn on the relays in turn the appliances. The diagram, this is a simulation diagram. I have simulated and it works, in, it works fine. The Android Blue Smart Socket um, this is an Android app you can install on your, uh, any Android device. It will, works on Android framework 2.2 and above. And a socket, this is a simple app which is a, just a turn on and turn off. Uh, whenever you turn on the socket, that socket will turn on and turn off when you turn off. And um, such device will look for all the Bluetooth devices. When you put everything inside the chip, inside this socket, it will look like this. Thank you. Okay. I just turned on all of the power. Uh, we need, we have two power sources. One for this board, which is 5 volts. The other for the this light, which is um, 12 volt, they can handle um, one, one 10 volts. If you if you see, when you turn on, it's going to show you um, a welcome message, okay, with the temperature of 34 cells, current temperature, okay, with device, and this is a relay which is connected to the power um, light. And this relay will get the signal from the microcontroller, which is this is a PIC microcontroller. Uh, I'm using a PIC uh, 684 or 689, PIC 689 that I have shown you earlier in my presentation. Okay, um, this is a um, um, this is a temperature sensor which is connected to the channel channel one. Okay green one this is my Android phone smartphone LG G2 okay I have um, I'm going to this is my app which is a blue smart socket I have created in an Android um, framework um, so it's a pretty simple let's look at So it's going to show something like that, and you have uh, the status which is um, not connected. It is not the smart. The app is not connected to the any Bluetooth device at this time. So it has a um, socket, a few sockets, five sockets. At this time, I implemented only for the five sockets, but you can extend to any sockets any number of sockets it's up to the the chip uh, number of ports available on the chip 
um, so it's not connected to it's not paired to any device like mobile so let's connect that mobile de um, device to search search device it found two devices now this is the one which is current device so let's turn on this. quick it quickly connected to SC05 okay if you look at the status of the Bluetooth device, it's not blinking. It's the socket one is connected to the, that light. So, on demand, I wanted to turn on the light. Okay, you are somewhere in the room or in the, you know, and you wanted to turn on the light in the, at a home, okay? Alright, turn on. There you go. Turn on. You turn on the with do it. Okay, I'm going to turn off. All right, turn off. So by using this, you can operate any any device. Um, I'm also can can show you. I forgot. Light and the fan, they're working, and I have both turn off. Okay, let's turn on. Turn on. So I'm going to turn off. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> 